Yeah, so today um, we've been doing a lamb amputation on Dudley, who was a young bull that suffered a catastrophic injury to his left rear leg. And the result of that was he lost his foot. And so he's been unable to walk for a very long period of time. And it's been causing him some very severe pain and distress, uh, weight loss and, and uh, muscle mass loss and very difficult time moving around. And so uh, he has a, what we would refer to as a catastrophic or life-threatening injury from the standpoint that if we can't get him back walking on four legs, eventually he will die as a result of complications from that injury. And so if you look at your uh, middle and third finger, uh, he essentially lost the last two bones um, in his foot. And that's what they walk on. And so the only thing he was left was the upper part of the digit. So your first bone in your finger, the amputation occurred at about the level of the first knuckle. And uh, that's not something that you can walk on pain-free. Uh, there's two things about the mentality of a patient that has a prosthetic limb. One of them is they have to be willing. And so one of the things that we see with Dudley when he's in our uh, sand bedded stall is that he will set the leg down. He does want to walk on it. And so he still has the mental capacity to use that limb as opposed to just picking it up and carrying it and not trying. And the other one is the way they interact with people. Uh, obviously, we can't explain to him what we're trying to do. And so what's important with Dudley is that uh, mentally he will allow people to work around him and work around his leg. If the caretakers can't take care of the leg, then the prosthesis isn't going to work. Um, this is something that has to be taken off and cleaned every single day. The limb has to be inspected to make sure that he's not getting sores and whatnot. Um, needs to be very carefully monitored. And so uh, managing an animal in a prosthetic limb is a, is a very much a labor of love because it's necessary to take very close care of them. And so we use cast material to um, uh, very carefully mold the legs so that the prosthetic company can make a reverse mold of the limb and they'll use that to build the prosthesis for his limb. The first thing they do when they set it down is they want to see if it hurts. And if it doesn't hurt, then they'll start testing it and whatnot. And some animals will immediately start bearing weight on it. Some animals, it takes weeks for them to adjust to having the prosthesis. Some of that is just building their muscle mass back up. Yeah, so Dudley is the, is the first bull that we've done. And he's the first bovine to have a prosthetic limb done, done here at the University of Tennessee. And so we're really excited to be able to work with him.